All right, we're gonna try and get through this one more time without me looking at the TV. <laughs> all right, we're gonna try this all the way over again. One more again, one more time. Wait, no, that's not what I wanna say. Bonjour, mon petits. It is I, the Fabulous Treats, back with a new video. And in today's video, we are going to be doing this dope cut crease look. Um, It's, I don't wanna say it's like a sunset, cut crease because it's not really a sunset it's more like just reds and purples um but uh it's it's a cut crease and we're gonna do it uh don't mind my one eye bigger than the other one one my crooked cut creases i got one with more lid space than the other one y'all know my eyes is broken and crooked and i got all kinds of stuff going on in my situation so don't pay attention to it don't don't pay it no mind i did this eye first and i realized that when i got to this eye that i wanted more lid space so i did more lid space Either way, it's still cute, so we're going to make it work, and we're going to rock out with it. So, if you want to see how I got this look, make sure you keep on watching, and I'll catch you on the other side. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. So we're going to take a fluffy brush and dip it in this orange color in the Jaclyn Hill palette. Now we're going to take this color from the 35B palette and put that right below that. And as you can see, I've lost a little bit of my orange. So now I'm just going to go back in with that fluffy brush and the orange color and just build that back up and make it visible again, but making sure that I'm blending the two colors really well. Now you wanna just clean that brush off a little bit and you're gonna go into this color, this, this pinkish purple color, you're gonna put that right in the crease. Now you wanna go into this purple color in the 35B palette, you're gonna put that right in the crease as well. All right, now we're gonna go with that darker purple and just deepen up the crease a bit more. All right, now we wanna take a denser crease brush and we're gonna go into the black from the Morphe 35B palette. Barely any product on the brush. All right, now we're gonna take that dark purple and go over the black again because we don't want the black to look black, we just want it to look dark purple. All right, so now we're gonna cut our crease. All right, now we're gonna take a flat brush and we're going to take Giza in the Juvia's Place um, Masquerade palette. We're gonna pack that all over the lid. Now we're gonna take our black liner and do a very small wing. Now I'm gonna go back into the Masquerade palette and taking the color Makita, and I'm just gonna go right over top of that liner real quick. So I went ahead and did my brows off camera. Yes, they are purple. And now I'm gonna speed through and turn the music up and finish the rest of my face. Um, if you guys want to know any of the products that I use, feel free to drop me a comment below and I will gladly let you know. Enjoy! Okay guys, so that brings us to the end of another tutorial with Trees. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure you do me a big old favor and hit that like button. And since we're hitting buttons, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well. If you're feeling anything about this video, anything about this look, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join Mon Petites, come on around and make sure your notifications are on because I be dropping these videos like clockwork every Thursday at noon. And um, I think that's all there is to say. And there is no more except, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you, love you, love you. And I will catch you in the next video. Mwah. Bye. <laughs>